YouTube channel. Uh, it, I haven't made another video since my last competition with Glifting Girls, um, but I did compete again at Pure Elite, and I did pretty well. <laughs> um, I came second place in International Model and third place in Miss Bikini, um, which means I got two pro cards, so I'm now a Pure Elite pro. Uh, which was so exciting and I had an amazing time. So I'm gonna take you through both competitions now and then I also have my favorite protein pancake recipe which I'll share with you later. So, hope you enjoy. At Pure Elite, I had an awesome time with everyone there. I met some amazing girls both at the po um, Audrey's um, posing class, Pure Elite closing, posing class. And then also through social media, I just began knowing um, some of the contestants and then met them in person and it was so much fun. I had an amazing experience. Um, so I think I'm going to continue on with both Glifting Girls and Pure Elite this season. Um, but since my last competition, um, I um, was I had to leave the UK because my visa expired. Um, I wasn't a student anymore, I graduated. So um, after graduation, I went back to the States for two months, um, saw a lot of my family, um, I got my personal training and nutrition qualifications, um, and then now I'm back in England. I'm doing my master's here in London. So I've already got a chance to meet up with a few of my um, Fitspiration um, Instagram chicks, uh, which has been really, really fun, and there are so, so many fun fitness expos and um, meetups that are happening in London, so stay tuned for those because I'm recording another one in about two weeks when I go to one of these expos, so I'm really excited. Uh, loving the fact being back in England. The weather hasn't been great, but whatever. I'm not really big on weather anyway, so future plans moving on. Um, Obviously, it made me focus on my masters, um, but I don't know whether to compete this season or if I should just train harder, get a little bit more muscle tone, and then cut down. So we'll kind of see how this works. I think I've got another month to decide if I want to compete this season or if I want to wait until next season. So we'll just see what happens. Um, other than just competitions, I've got some photo shoots coming up, which are super exciting. Um, not just with Werewolf, with a couple other people, so I'll keep you posted with that. I've been sent some um, different things to try out, so I've got some videos coming up with um, those kind of reviews. Um, but today is all about Shapey, which is a new protein company um, in England. This They sent me this um, blue blip blueberry protein and it's amazing actually I usually only eat chocolate protein or chocolate peanut butter as I like to make it into like this kind of mousse um, and then eat it with a spoon basically it's kind of like eating a chocolate sauce or like a chocolate peanut butter spread but the blueberry works just as well and I'm actually liking it better with um, Greek yogurt um, as like a before bed snack or um, putting it on top of my protein pancakes mm. So, um, they're doing a trip giveaway to Ibiza, actually, so check out their social media, go to their Instagram, look on how you can get to Ibiza and get out of this dreary weather. Hi guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make my favorite breakfast, um, protein pancakes. Now, you can use any protein, obviously, but I am using Shapey. So while my pan is heating up, the first step I'm going to do is take half of this banana and mash it up really well. I don't have a blender, you could also put it in a blender, um, but this will be the base of my protein pancakes. So you can use any kind of flour you want. I like using um, my flour from Sucrin. Um, this company is organic and they are gluten-free flour, which 
Um, I'm not really big on the whole gluten-free for um, health reasons, but for me personally, it helps me not bloat. Um, so I can enjoy my pancakes and not be really bloated after. So I have the Sucrin almond flour, peanut flour, and sesame flour. And today I'm gonna make my pancakes with the sesame one. Total Zero yogurt, um, about 10 grams of walnuts, and then the leftover half of my banana. So those are my shapey protein pancakes. They're really, really good. I can't even stress it enough. Um, but these pancakes that I've made are about 600-ish um, calories, and that's because of the way I made it. So you could reduce the amount of flour you use. You could um, use egg whites instead of all egg, you know, so that would take a lot of calories out already. And then you could use one scoop of Shapey instead of two scoops, but I'm using this as my pre-workout meal. I'm kind of combining two meals together because I woke up late, got to sleep in today. So um, yeah, try them out. Let me know if you like them and I hope you enjoy. 